And now an update to an 8 on your side investigation. The results are in for a big test at Plato Academy in Largo. And they come as no surprise to many of the parents and teachers there. Mold in the classroom. Some parents and teachers spent years complaining about that. News Channel 8 broke the story when they showed us some pictures of the problem. 8 on your side's Paul Mueller joining us now live in Clearwater where tonight's meeting took place. All right, Paul, parents showed us the pictures and now we've confirmed it's true mold. That's right. It is true. The testing has now come back, and tonight we know there is indeed mold here at the school. But the founder insisting that mold is everywhere, that it's on me, that it's on you, and of course it's here at the school. What's the problem here? What's the big problem? The big problem is that they keep saying there is no problem. Alyssa Coker says she's tired of the excuses, and Friday night, the mother of two got the answers she was waiting for. Our kids go into a moldy classroom every day. And the company chosen by the school to inspect the Largo campus, Pure Air, backed up those findings. Moisture problems in the air ducts and in the floors. Founder Steve Christopoulos tried to explain himself. I'm going to say all along, all along that there is no more. But with the test results showing there is, he's now backing down just a bit. Now, when you say there is no more, it means there is no more of significant level to be harmful. They said that you were trying to hide it and conceal it, were you? How can I hide it and conceal it? This is a second inspection at the school in the last few weeks. This time, mold, yes, while the quality of the indoor air, adequate. No immediate health concerns found. That's not reassuring, though, to many parents who said their kids have gotten sick breathing problems they blame on the school. If your kids were at this age to go to this school, would you send them here today? Oh, definitely. A different answer from other parents, including Coker, who would rather pull their kids out than risk their health. They say it's safe for your kids to go in there. Are you going to let them in? We're changing schools, actually. A common sentiment echoed by a lot of parents. All right, we wanted to know, is anyone going to get fired over this? How about suspended? Anything? The answer, Keith, no. All right. Paul Mueller live in Clearwater tonight. Thank you, Paul.